Underground Throwdown. What's up, guys? This is Bondman Two Two Five, and we are back with Pokemon Gold no Gold No Gold Nuck Gold Nuck Gold Nuzlocke. Good Lord, words, words, words. Um, full disclosure: this is probably not going to be a very exciting episode because the Radio Tower in Golden Red City is a landmark. They're running a promotional campaign right now. They'll modify your Poké Gear so it can also serve as a radio. How exciting is that? Not very. Um, I'm just going to be exploring this town. I'm going to be doing a whole lot of shopping. Um, there might be one or two battles towards the end in the underground, but for the most part, it's it's you know, it's just me walking around, talking to people, doing things. The department store is a decent selection, but sometimes our items are only available as game quarter prizes. I'm raring to shop again today! So like, I know some people out there are, are, are like, they're keen to see like the actual, like the battles and the actual Nuzlocke challenge part of the Nuzlocke, but I enjoyed this part, and tell you what, I haven't actually played this game since like, before the remakes came out, so like I forget where half the items and stuff are, so I like talking to everybody because I forget things. And what do you say? Welcome to Golden Rat Department Store! That, is that it? Okay. Well, uh, let's head upstairs. And let's see what everybody's selling. Welcome, how may I help you? Buy... I need more potions, so I'm gonna buy... some more potions. And I'll even buy... two super potions. Why not? Uh, I'm not gonna bother with any of those... just yet. Please come again. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Uh, what are you selling? Poke balls. I'm gonna buy some great balls. Yes. Yes. Oh, repels. Should I buy repels? I don't think I need them now. I'm not going through that forest anymore. Pokey Gear can store up to ten phone numbers. It's hard to decide which numbers to keep. I don't keep anybody's numbers. I hate everyone. I got my Haber at the game corner. Now it's my best partner. That's nice. This department store makes me realize that Goldenrod is a big city. The selection here is unmatched anywhere else. Mm-hmm. So yeah, if you want to skip this episode and just jump to the next one, I, I totally understand. I, I plan to fight Whitney in the next episode, so that'll that'll be an interesting one. Um, I, I, I'm really impatient! I, I use X speed in battle to speed up my Pokemon! Oh, I'm guessing you sell all the X items. Yes, you do. I don't like using X items, I don't know why. They're not items anymore, they're X items. <laughs> I promise I won't keep making that joke. Hey, when you battle, do you use X special? No. It's awesome. It just really jacks up the special stats. W were you not listening to what I said? I, I don't use X items. Glad somebody was paying attention. <laughs> not. Welcome. How many help you? Protein, ice, calcium. I don't really bother buying these either. Well, plus they're like ridiculously expensive. Um, so I'm not going to worry about that. Hey, I love strong Pokemon. I, I feed the protein to crank up their attack. Do they have protein shakes? Uh, they just like get jacked up. Some Pokemon evolved only by being traded by a gangling cable. I know a four. Machoke, Kadabra, Haunter, and a Graveler. I heard there are others too, probably. I forget who they are. Iron adds up your Pokemon's defense. Don't care. Don't care. Where's the TMs? Is this the TMs? That's what I'm interested in. Mystery gift! With just a little beep, you get a gift. Fascinating. Fascinating stuff. You can't rename a Pokemon that you get in a trade. The name is a reflection of the original trainer's feelings for it. Ooh, he has feelings! I collect Pokemon! Do you have Drowsy? I do! Wanna trade it for my Machop? No. Because I don't believe in trading in Nuzlocke. Um, if this was a legit copy of the game and not an emulator, I'm sorry I'm on an emulator because I don't have a way to record it otherwise, um, I'm totally okay with trading to get evolutions. Like, if you have a Kadabra, like, trade it to another game and trade it back to get Alakazam. But I don't use, like, the in-game trades and stuff like that. That's just not me, man. Not me. Uh, you're the TM guy! Ah, oh, so he has... Oh, I can't even afford them. Dang, I can't afford them. Oh, well. Uh, but if you can get a Kadabra and teach it, like, the three elemental punches, like, you win. Um... <laughs> It's insane! Because they, they're considered special moves in this game, so it's great. Uh, did I talk to you already? 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, you're the you're that guy. What about you? Did I talk to you, little girl? Oh yeah, you're Mr. Gift. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello. On Sundays, a lady comes to check out Pokemon. She even gives away tombs. Well, it is not Sunday. At the day of recording, it is a Friday. You guys probably won't see this until Monday. Uh, do you listen to Lucky Channel? If you want to win, trade Pokemon with as many people as possible to get different ID numbers. Nah. If you're tired, try the vending machine drinks. Your Pokemon will love them too. Uh oh. Uh, well, no, I'm not gonna buy them now. I don't want them now. What, is there anybody hiding in the corner? No. No. Uh, oh, I'm on the top floor. Well, this shopping center wasn't as big as I remember it being, uh, but I'm gonna go to the basement. Check out the basement. Oh, look at this choke. Macho, macho man. I want to be a macho man. Is there anything here? No. What a useless room. Hey, I'm talking to you. Hey, kid, you're holding us up. Our policy is to work behind the scenes when no one can see us. Well, don't let me stop you, just keep going. Wah! Wah! The stuff on the ground's junk. Take it if you want it. Wah! Wah! Why does he say wah! Wah! Like that. Also, I can't get to the junk. I lose my passion for work if someone's watching. Come on, kid, scoot. Oh, fine. I believe you can come back later after the whole, like, radio tower drama. Spoilers, there's a radio tower drama. Don't worry, that won't be for a while. You'll probably forget I even said anything by the time we get to it. Well, that's the shop. Wait, did I talk to you guys? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I talked to everybody here. I talked to everybody here, and you're giving away stuff at the radio station. Well, she's not, but she's talk telling me about it. Your playground, Golden Road City Game Corner. I don't think I'm actually going to do the game corner. Uh, I will talk to people though. I couldn't win at the slots and I blew it on card flipping. I got so furious I tossed out my coin case in the underground. Yeah, I can't even do anything in here till I get that. I tapped Blizzard to my Pokemon. It was hard to get enough coins for it, but it was worth it. Totally worth it, bruh. I always play the slot machine. It pays out more than others, I think. He has cool shades. Now this dude's fat. I just love this new slot machine, it's more of a challenge than the ones in Celadon. Life is a game booth, I'm going to flip cards till they drop. Lovely. Card flip! I have it over the slots because it's easy to figure the odds, but the payout is much lower. What do you say? I won't quit until I win. That's nice. Um. Well, that was... Largely uneventful. What's going on? Hey, hey, hey man, what's going on? Woo! There's just one big town! I don't know where anything is! Me neither, man. Me neither. What's down here? Underground. No, I don't want to do the underground yet. I'll do that at the end. Oh, is this Bill's house? Oh, you collect Pokemon? My son Bill is an expert. He had to leave for the Pokemon Center in Equitique City. Are you a trainer? I've got a useful phone number for you. Yes. Hey, I got Bill's number. Why is his, like, little sister handing out his number? Assuming that is his sister. Oh, it is! Hey! My big brother Bill made the PC Pokemon storage system! And now I can talk to Bill. Is there any benefit to talking to Bill? He doesn't even know who I am, so let's just call him and he'll be like, Who the hell are you? Let's do it. Let's do it. Good day. This is the Pokemon storage system administration service. Who's calling? Ballet, is it? Hang on a sec. Thanks for waiting. Ballet, your box has room for 13 more Pokemon. Get out there and fill it up. Oh, that's actually quite useful. That's actually very useful. Hmm. Very useful indeed. What up, Holmes? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I got into trouble for playing in the basement of the department store. <laughs> what a creepy man. Golden Rod City, the festive city of opulent charm. <laughs> Man, what? I know there's a new bike shop, but I can't find it anywhere. Hello. 
If you treat your Pokemon nicely, they will love you in return. Oh, let me see your Zubat. You should treat it better. It's not used to you. But it will be. When I use an item on my Pokemon, it acts really glad. I keep losing in battles and my Pokemon end up fainting. Maybe that's why my Pokemon don't like me much. Yeah. It's also because you smell like grapes. The world is a psychopath. Bike shop! Oh yeah, we're gonna get a free bike, man. Oop. There's a random toolbox in the way. <sighs> I moved here, but I can't sell my bicycles. Why is that? Could you ride a bicycle and advertise for me? Really? Great. Give me your name and phone number and I'll loan you a bicycle. Yes. Excellent. My bicycles are first rate. You can ride them anywhere. This is excellent news. Uh, so now I can go to my pack. And in the key items, I can go bicycle. And I can even hit select. And it's not actually select, I believe it's backspace on here. Yes! Yes, I have a bike. Look, I got the bike! I know there's a new bike shop, but I can't find a new... Oh, wait. He doesn't change. Oh, man, that must be a hot gold soul silver thing. Like, he changes and he's like, Hey, where'd you get that bike? Did I talk to you? Is that man in black dressed up like a Team Rocket member? How silly. They built the new radio tower to replace the old creaky one. That's, that's lovely. City Station, Goldenrod City Station. Hello. Well, the train hasn't come in. I know, I'll carry the passengers on my back. Well, it won't work, unless they're ants. Are they ants? Ant passengers. So this is the radio tower. What do you want, you pest? Scream! Okay, I'll just head inside. Welcome! Is, is that it? That's, uh, that's, that's it, apparently. Uh, there's a whole lot of, whole lot of things, and here's the man, and he's like, Hey, are you here for lucky number show? Want me to check the ID numbers of your Pokemans? If you get lucky, you win a prize. This week's ID number is 34300. Let's see if you have a match. Nope, none of your ID numbers match. Oh. We have a special quiz campaign on right now. Answer five questions correctly to win a radio card. Slide it into your pocket gear to play the radio anytime, anywhere. Would you like to take the quiz? Yes. Question one. Can the town map be displayed on a pokey gear? It sure can. Correct. Question two. Can Nidorina be female only? Uh, Nidorina. Hang on, Nidorina. Yes. <laughs> I had to think about that. Bullseye. Question three. Does Kurt, the Pokeball, that man, use Apricorn? I don't think it's spelt like that. So far, so good. Question four. Magikarp won't learn any team moves. Correct. Well, right again is the final question. Professor Oak's Pokemon Talk is a very popular program. Is Mary the co-host of the show? Yes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's Mary with a Y, isn't it? Oh, God. Okay. Here we go again. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, I would. Yes, it can. Correct. Question two. Nidorina can be male only. Female only. Yes. Bullseye. Question three. Does Kurt craft use Apricorns? No. So far, so good. Question four. Magikarp won't learn any TMOs. Yes. And again, this is the final question. All right. So it's a no. No. There we go. Bingo! You got it. Congratulations! It's your prize—a radio card. Ballet received a radio card. Ballet's Poké Gear can- Oh, hang on, that's not- she's not saying that. Please tune in to our radio shows! That- that's- that was her. I love Ma- yes, yeah, it's Mary with a Y. I love Mary from Pokemon Talk. I only know what she sounds like, though. Ah, oh, don't we all? Actually, I don't know what she sounds like. Because this has no voice acting. Ben is a fabulous DJ. His sweet voice makes me melt. Ooh. Ooh. Lullabies on the radio may make Pokemon sleep. Okay. Jigglypuff. Jiggly. Jiggly, 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 jiggly. You can listen to the radio anywhere. Tune in! I don't think I will. I don't... The radio really didn't do anything for me. Sorry, authorized personnel only beyond this point. If it, it wasn't that way before, there's something wrong with the director. I'm a karate man standing in the door for some reason. 
karate man standing in the door for no adequately explained reason. Cha 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 karate man. We went in there, we went in there. Oh, why aren't I riding everywhere? I have a bike, I should just ride everywhere. Why can't I ride on the train tracks? Why? The man at the house rates your Pokemon names. He can even rename your Pokemon. Name Raider. Get your Pokemon nicknames Raider. I don't want to do that. I like the names I have. Underground entrance. Oh, whoops. Oh, I, I didn't actually want to come in here, good sir. Terribly sorry, as you were. As you were. There's the gym, which I can't do much with at present. Here's the flower shop lady. La 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 la. Have plenty of water, my lovely. When I watered that moving tree on Route 36, it jumped! I think it must be a Pokémon, but it would take someone like Whitney, our gym leader, to beat it. Or someone like me. Someone like me. Once, while I was battling, my Pokémon couldn't make any moves. The power points, or PP, of its moves were all gone. PP. Sometimes, a healthy Pokémon may be unable to use its moves. If that happens, here at a Pokemon Center, I use an item. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, and now we're, we're at the end of the town. A strange tree is blocking the road. It wriggles around if you talk to it. I heard it becomes wild when bloated with a squirt bottle. Oh, you, you're kidding, you guy. Excuse me, guy. Can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? He's on Route 31. No. Oh, never mind, then. Um, we'll deal with him later, and I'll sort of go into more detail about how I feel about him. Let's head into the underground. I was challenged to a battle downstairs. It's rough down there. You'd better be careful. Finally, some action. Um, let's, let's check the Pokemans. Yeah, I want Adam West out in front. Adam West. I think you may have some rare Pokemon with you. Let me see them. Well, I have a Chikorita. That's kind of rare. Everybody else is fairly standard, but... Pokemaniac Donald wants to fight. Pokemaniac Donald sent out Slowpoke. I have one of them. Uh, I'm worried that it might have... Con oh, what? Mine doesn't have confusion, so it shouldn't. Nah, I'll, just, I'll, I'll switch to Grassley anyway. Just to be safe. Meow. Ah, see, it just, it just knows tackle. It just knows tackle. That's, that's not scary at all. I'm actually going to put Razor Leaf down the front here. Bam! There goes Slowpoke. It's, it's super effective. And a West Grid level 11. I think it learns Bite at level 12, and then it can actually be kind of useful. So we'll keep on switch training it a little more. Grassley, that's enough! Come back! Go, Adam West! Um, let's just... let's lead life. Let's just see what happens. Probably not much, because it's not a very good attack. How much damage does it do? Uh, uh, I mean, I will keep healing myself, so... You know what, let's stick it out. Let's just see how we do. Yeah, see, I'm healing myself. As long as it just keeps on using tackle like that, like, we should be fine. Oh man, but in Sun and Moon, though, Leech Life got a serious buff. It now has, like, a base power of 80. It's, like, a ridiculously good move now. Like, it doesn't make any sense. So weird, but it's it's amazing now. Like I got it in a TM, and I'm like, I got Leech Life in a TM. How lame! And then I looked at it, and I'm like, Whoa! What do they do to you, Leech Life? Adam Ice could have taken on both the Slowpokes. Ah oh, well. Oh yeah! Pokemon Ad Donald was defeated. Gah! I lost. That makes me mad. It makes me mad. Hello. Do you consider type alignments in battle? If you know your type advantages, you'll do better in battle. I'd try to consider them, except when I forget that poison is weak to ground. 
Oh man, four Pokemans. Magnemite! Oh no, we gotta get Adam West out of here! Uh, so hang on, Steel and Electric. Uh, Geochick is actually our best bet here. Yeah. Uh, fortunately, Levitate isn't a thing yet, so it can still be hit by ground type moves. Aha, does the don't affect me none! Magnitude 7! Adam West gained some experience! Voltorb. So I am gonna keep switch training Adam West, because I want it to learn Bite. Once it learns Bite, it can actually kind of do things in battle, so it'll be easier to train without switch training every five seconds. Um, I'm not as worried about this Electrode, so I'm actually gonna switch to Toastia. I mean this Voltorb. Because I don't think Voltorb actually has any like electric type moves. So we can just... Confusion. i got to start putting like my proper moves at the top. Ah, uh, Confusion! Because I don't want to accidentally like use Tackle in the wrong moment or anything like that. That'd be, that'd be a bad plan! That'd be... Oh wow, that did not do... Out of curiosity, what if we use Tackle? That's, yeah, Confusion. I think Confusion's doing that slight bit more. Ooh, defense harshly fell. Harshly. Confusion. Come on, Toast. Tank it. Ah, oh, yeah, nice. Nice! Nice, nice, baby. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Uh, I was about to send in Magnemite. Yes. Alright, now we're going to start switch training Rodriguez. Toast, that's enough. Come back. Go, Rodriguez. Uh, oh, wait. You didn't have electric moves. No. No. Geochick. It's your turn again. My friend. Thundershock, you don't affect Geochick. It don't affect me none! Magnitude 7! Oh, you are so dead. I'm like, over double your level. Bing! Geo Chick, we're level 19! Super Nerd Teru is about to use Magnemite! Another Magnemite? Oh, man. Alright, Rodriguez. Switch Train. Nintendo Switch Train. Rodriguez! And back again. <laughs> back again. Under shock. It, it, don't, it don't do nothing to me, man. It don't do nothing. It don't do nothing. Goodbye. Super Nerd Terror was defeated. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> uh, I can't, oh, I can't go. The door's locked. No one should be on this point. Fair enough. I suppose I'll just have to come back later. Hello. Welcome to the Pokemon Salon. I'm the younger and less expensive of the two haircut brothers. I'll spiff your Pokemon for just $300, so how about it? Yes! I am going to give a haircut to Adam West. Boost its happiness a little bit, because once it evolves into Golbat, I'll need to raise its happiness to get it to evolve into Crobat. There we go, all done! Adam West looks a little happier. Although, when does the good haircut guy come? I think he's like Tuesdays and Thursdays, maybe? Because he gives even more happiness. And there's the coin case. And you're a battle too, aren't you? My Pokemon just got haircuts. I'll show you how strong they are. Go ahead. Show me. Show me your moves. Lickitung. Lickitung. Hey, Adam West. Uh, actually, no. I'm gonna switch out for Rod 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 Rodriguez. Enemy Lickitung is cut! Uh, 
headbutt. Aha, uh -huh, it missed. It missed. Oh, that didn't do very much at all. Um. Alright, then Grassley. Fine. <laughs> I guess maybe using a special base move is probably the way to go. Pow! Oh, it's, man, it's only slightly better. And that cut is... I'm not happy about that cut. He's cutting me up, man! He's cutting me deep! Yeah, I'm gonna use a, uh... Wait, how much health? I... Uh, 28. I'll just use a... I'll just use a normal potion here. Ooh. 20 HP... Man, stop cutting me! Also, Razor Leaf is supposed to have a higher critical hit rate. I swear it does not. It is a bunch of baloney. Alright, Lickitung is out! Goodbye, Lickitung! Adam West gained some experience. Grassley gained some experience. Everybody gained some experience, and he's all like, Aye! Oh man, is another one? I got booted out of the game corner. I was trying to cheat using my Pokemon. Who are you? Super Nerd Eric. Eric the Hoffa B. Rhymer. Rhymer. Uh, you know what? Let's bite him. Oh, oh but he flinched. Yeah, he's flinching. It, oh, damn it. Dang it. Sorry. Just, there we go. There we go. Stupid emulators. Oh. Okay, never mind. Rodriguez. Good thing after this fight, like, that's all the fights in this town, and I can go heal up. I can go and heal up. Man. Haha, -ha, this Grimer keeps flinching. He's so scared. Oh, oh wait, no, that's it. Man, for the briefest of moments, I thought that he did that to me. Man, I'm a little tired. Uh, another Grimer. Uh, Rodriguez. Headbutt. Bam. Poison gas. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, great. Um... Alright. You have incurred my wrath, good sir. And now it is time for you to get super duper... I... whoops. No. Super duper confused. Bam! Are you dead now? Are you dead now? Oh, what? How dare you not be dead? Why, why would you keep using Harden? Oh, well, he's dead now. He's dead now. Rodriguez grew to level 12. And Rodriguez needs to learn some new moves. Super nerd Eric was defeated. Grumble. Ballet got $352 for winning. Oh, that's right. I need to get to Pokemon Center. There are some shops downstairs, but there are also trainers. I'm scared to go down there. Uh, how is your health, actually, Rodriguez? 33. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. You're not gonna die on me on this little trip to the Pokemon Center. Hello, welcome to our Pokemon Center. Yes, heal them, please. Uh, well, we explored all of the town. Hmm, it's kind of a short episode, and the next one's going to be a slightly shorter one too, because it's against Whitney. You know what I think I shall do? I shall just get Adam West and Rodriguez up one more level, I think. We'll just sort of go out into the bush and, uh, and train. So let's, let's just do that for a bit. Uh, I'm even going to put on my bicycle so I can run around faster. So the Pokemon will jump out at me faster. Oh, it's an Abra. 
I wanted an Abra. Um, I mean, Drowsy's okay too, I guess. But, yeah. That's. Oh. Damn. That's what happens. Oh, a Drowsy. Oh, Drowsy appeared. Go out of West. So I keep forgetting. Bite is considered like dark. All dark type moves are considered special in this game. It's super effective, but it fails. Ja. And he flinched. Oh, so close! It. Oh, really? 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 Are you serious, Drowsy? Are you serious right now? Are you serious? I could just use an awakening, but I, I, re I really cannot, cannot be bothered. I I'm already asleep, you stupid drowsy. Okay, wake up. Wake up, Adam West. Wake up. But <laughs> Man, wild Pokemon are so dumb sometimes. Yeah, 1 HP! Whoop whoop! Oh, so close! Alright, one more battle and he should level up. Riding my bike and then a wild drowsy appears. Go, Adam West! Uh, bite! Chicket chicket! It's super effective! Wild drowsy flinched! Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it, Drowsy. Pound. Pound. And let me guess, now it's gonna put me to sleep. Oh, it flinched! Yes! <laughs> That's always the way. When you one attack away from finishing it, it puts you to sleep. Adam West could be level 13. Now that Adam West can actually fight, leveling him up goes so much faster. Uh, Rodriguez, it is your turn. Uh, actually, uh, let's let's uh, let's just like look in on everybody's stats as well. Rodriguez, um, you're definitely more of a physical fighter at the moment. Once you turn into a slow bro, uh, yeah, slow bro though, it gains a lot more special based powers. Subat. Slightly favors physical attacks. Grassley slightly favors, again, slightly favors physical attacks, but you're fairly balanced otherwise. Butterfree definitely favors special powers. Uh, Your chick is definitely a physical fighter as well. Alright, cool. Oh, dang it. All of the. No, I'm, I'm not pressing that button. Wait, did I put uh, Rodriguez in front? I did! Good. Good. Let's get him up one more level, and then we will call it quits for there. An Abra. I don't think it's even worth fighting this thing. It's gonna just run away from me anyway. But oh well. Yep. Enemy Abra fled from battle. Drowsy. Drowsies are quite bulky though. That's the only. Slightly annoying things that this might take a while. Aha! It doesn't affect me! It will next time though. Uh, oh, that's doing much more damage than I expected it to. Oh. Dang it! <laughs> Why? Why? Now I have to use tackle. Ugh. That's not gonna work. You can't disable me twice, man. Don't work like that. It don't work like that. Alright, I reckon two more- Oh! Hey, it's Youngster Joey! Ballet, howdy, it's me, Joey! Isn't it nice out? My radith is looking awesome! I wish I could show you! Oh yeah! I managed to beat a tough Pidgey! I need to make my party stronger! See you later! He's just repeating himself now. I always like how he just adds, Oh yeah! to his sentences, it's great. Oh yeah! Uh, oh, a Rattata? Rattata! Headbutt. Oh, quick attack. Quick attack. Hmm. Blonk. 
Tail whip me all you like. Honey Badger does not care. Okay, I might take a couple more fights. If we end up fighting Raditors, they don't give us much experience. We now know. It's a drowsy- Oh, nah, it's a Raditor. It's the Raditor. Go, Rodriguez. Headbutt. Tackle! Critical hit! I do not approve of this. Tackle. <laughs> Alright, we might have to use a potion real quick. Ah, oh, one more battle away. Uh, well, you know what? Because I can't be bothered to use a potion to heal him up. We'll just, we'll just switch him out. Um, who is it? It's another drowsy. It's another drowsy. Um, yeah, let's actually send Adam West back out. Why not? Whoop. Enemy drowsy is pound. This is actually a pretty good training spot. At this at this stage of the game. Like half the other training spots, it feels like your Pokemon are all like way more powerful than the wild Pokemon around. So like that that's what was happening in the in the in the Slowpoke well where I was trying to train. Like it just wasn't working because all of the Pokemon were too weak, and I was getting so little experience off them. But here it's actually semi-decent. So I probably will do a bit of a little bit of grinding before the Whitney fight because I actually can do some grinding here and it won't take like six weeks. <laughs> ah, disabled, really? Oh well, I'll just finish you off with a bite then. Goodbye. Yay, Rodriguez, good level thirteen. Still no new moves though, sadly. Alright, I'm going to go back to Pokemon Center heal up, and uh, we're pretty much done for this episode. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for checking out this episode. Um, if you happen to sit through to the end, because I know there was very little action, it was a very boring episode. But sometimes, you know, sometimes I just, I just like to take a breather, talk to some people, just slow things down. So, uh, thank you very much. Uh, if you liked this video, uh, give me a like. That way I know that you liked it, and I can keep doing things that you guys like. Uh, leave a comment, tell me, just let me know how, how it's going. How are you? Let me know in the comments how you are. And um, obviously subscribe so that you can check out the rest of this playthrough as it happens. Uh, thank you very much ladies and gentlemen. Keep it real and keep it fun man.